describe these cookies as just so pleasing to the eye. You look at them and it's you want to jump in there, but first you want to take a picture because they're really pretty. So we talked at the top of the show about uh, making a box full of cookies. You gave us some great tips, but I'd love to know what you put in the box of cookies. So you put a couple, two or three types of each kind that you have over here. Yes, exactly. Why don't you walk us through? Sure. So I have, these are lemon cream cheese cookie sandwiches. Oh. So they're a soft cookie with an, a cream cheese icing in the middle. Oh. Then a classic chocolate chip cookie. I just sprinkled a little bit of sea salt on top because it just adds yeah. a little bit, it breaks it up a little bit. Yeah. The Toblerone shortbread that we made. Yep. Then the classic macarons, they just, tie everything together. They're so colorful and pretty. They do, they're gorgeous. A chocolate sugar cookie. Ooh, nice. And then a vanilla sugar cookie, which we're gonna be making right now. Okay, yeah. so those are all vanilla sugar cookies These just decorated all, a little bit different. Exactly, and you can have so much fun with them. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so how do we make the sugar okay. cookie? So if you want some pretty, like, room temperature butter. This one's a little bit harder okay. than I would want it, but pretty soft. All right. And then you're just gonna cream it how you would your cream and butter, so, or your butter and your sugar. Yep. You just wanna get that you get incorporated. It a yeah, you just want it to like nicely incorporate butter everywhere. Is this the sort of thing in real life that you would put in like a stand mixer? Or would you usually yeah. use your hand? Okay. I use a stand mixer, it's so much easier, yeah. right? And then I'm just from looking here... for an excuse to get one is really what's happening. <laughs> you need one. That's what I want. Because they're so More beautiful. Baking. And yeah. I'm thinking, what would I and use? Your kitchen you for? accessory. They're right? beautiful yeah. accessory. But yes, you, you can, can use, use them for everything. in this instance. Yeah. And then what I would do is add in my egg and then my flour and it just comes together like yeah. a perfect dough. Just like that. Very nice. Yeah. And as I've mentioned before, we do put the recipes online. Yes. It's baking, so you got to kind of be a, a little bit specific. And so. it takes a little time to get things yes. going and moving, right? Yes. So and that's CityLine.tv. Your end result is going to be a nice, smooth dough. Yeah. It's going to be a lot um, firmer than the dough that we made for the shortbread because you're going to roll it out, right? Okay. So once you have this dough, you're going to form it into a ball, refrigerate it, pull it out, and then roll this baby. Okay. And then you're going to have. This beautiful Yeah, glass. it's fully rolled out. Nice. So you have that, and I'm gonna have you cut a few shapes, so whatever oh, you wanna do. Oh, this is great. Yeah, it's so fun. It's so, fun. in the end, I believe we're gonna be making, um, they're gonna be little sandwiches, aren't they? These ones are, no, these are the sugar cookies, so they're like nice vanilla sugar cookies. Oh, so cookies. we're not gonna put two of them together? Not for these, because these are a little, well, you can. Just smash you them together in real life. Yeah. But yeah, we're not going to do that. No we're just going to ice you. them. We're just going to yeah. ice them. And then okay. those, what you're going to do is, yeah, once you have these, all you want to do is just place them on your baking sheet. The beauty of this dough is it doesn't spread. So okay. these are not going to grow in the oven. So they're going to stay nice and cute. Oh, that's so good. cute. Yeah. I love Perfect. it. Perfect. Okay, awesome. And now I want to just great these babies so Thank I have some royal icing for you this is a very basic royal icing it's just sugar egg whites and water okay. very easy. okay so that's easy and yeah. just the difference between royal icing and a different kind of icing this one looks glazed this one looks glazed it looks and shiny yes right and it hardens and it dries very very shiny so yeah. it gets very very hard unlike your typical buttercream which right. stays soft, right? So those ones over there that you have, like yes. the, the red or the coral, is yes. that just food coloring? That's food coloring. Nice. So we're gonna do marbled. So I'm oh. gonna add a little bit of lime. Okay. And the best way to get a marble is add your color in three different spots. Okay. And then all you wanna do is just very gently swirl it, but you don't wanna really incorporate the color. So. Just like beautiful, perfect. Okay. Yeah, amazing. Okay, and this is so fun and so easy, and we can use some sprinkles. Do I? Am I just gonna dip it? You're just dipping them, okay. and then you just put them on the wire rack. Okay. So you just go all in. Yeah, beautiful. Just pull it out straight like that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love how that looks. You're so pretty. If you want to pizzazz them up a little bit while they're still wet, you can just add some sprinkles. Oh, you want to add all of so your good. little, yeah, add everything while they're still wet. So then when they dry, you have beautiful. Little I wish sugar I cookies. did this. This is the mom my daughter wants. This is the mom <laughs> she, she wants me to be. This mom. You so can do them with her. They're maybe so fun. I can learn to do yes. that. Like yeah. I'm gonna read the I'm gonna read the instructions online because this is amazing. Cityline.tv, Joti, you're awesome.